The reason I personally like Purple Martins is because they're purple. <laughs> they're blue, uh, that's my favorite color. The males are very shiny purple, blue color. It's just nice walking outside and hearing their song, you know, in the mornings. Watching them when they feed uh, on the fields here, they will just swoop across collecting insects and it's fun to watch their acrobatics. And Purple Martins here on campus are such a great teaching tool. Uh, one thing about Purple Martins is that they are so um, tolerant of human activity. As a matter of fact, they will only nest within a certain, they have to be within a certain distance to human activity. If they get too far, they won't nest. Naturally, other humans will keep the, their other predators that might come after them away. But being that they are as domesticated as you could expect a wild animal to be, the housing that we have here on campus uh, is really able to be uh, lowered and raised real easily. And so what we do is we bring the kids out here. And they can take a look at the nest, the eggs, the babies during the nesting cycle. And the Martins, uh, not only do they not mind, but checking the nest and, and keeping up with everything that's going on inside the nest actually increases their reproductive success because you can catch things like possible mite outbreaks or anything that might be going wrong. Purple martins feed on insects on on the wing as they say that means that they when they feed they're actually flying uh, they provide a benefit to us by controlling the insect population. Aside from the direct effect, there's an indirect effect. Uh, we have started putting, we put a streaming nest cam in, advertised to the campus. I thought it was fun to watch the birds in their environment, but I, I like all the wildlife on campus, but I think that getting to watch the birds in their environment like that reminds us to be a little more conscious about the environment. We're sharing it with those birds and we gotta take care of it too.